Hello children. Today I will be teaching you all maths. Part 1. Lesson number 7. Counting in groups. Look at this picture. There are many shapes in it. Right? Now tell me can we count these shapes very quickly? No. Why no? Yes, right. Because it will take a long time to count so many shapes. So children, instead of counting so many shapes, we should make a group of shapes which will help us to count easily. Let's learn how to count in groups. Look at these cups. You can see in the first line there is only one cup. In the second line there are two cups. In the third line there are three cups. And in the fourth line there are four cups. So if we make group of these three cups and make group of another three cups and the last group that is of four cups then total how many groups we get of these cups yes right three groups so these three groups in which first group is having three cups and second group is having three cups and the third group is having four cups. So, how many cups are there all together? So, we'll add this three groups. That is three cups plus three cups plus four cups. How many cups we get? First, we'll add three plus three. That is equal to six. And six plus four is equal to ten. So, how many cups we get all together is 10 cups in total. Now children, look at the flowers. Can you count the number of flowers? Let's begin. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 11, 12, 13, 14. So how many flowers are there? Right, there are 14 flowers. I have made a group of 10 flowers that becomes 1 tails. Now there are 4 more flowers left which I do not wish to add in this group. We will keep these 4 flowers as another groups and name it has four units so children remember groups of stick means tens and single means units it is easier to count if we make a group of 10 like this like this example you saw that we have make a group of 10 flowers different and four flowers different. So that ten flowers we will that means it is one tens and the four remaining flower that will be named as four units. Now look at the other examples. There are three groups of sticks. You can see three groups of sticks and three single sticks. You can see there are three single sticks also and three group of stick also. So we can say that this three stick of group is three tens. That is three group of stick that means three tens and three single stick that means three units. So that is is 33 so 3 tens plus 3 unit is what 33 okay children 
I hope you all have understood this lesson. That's all for today. Thank you.